Talking about it, your tweets, no, it was interesting to see you tweet about how lucky you were to marry a guy who is more feminist than you. Mm -hmm. Do you want to elaborate on that? Yeah, Rahul is a feminist <laughs> and I'm, very, I'm actually a lot more feminist than I, than I am. A lot, uh, uh, actually absolutely not judgmental about, uh, about anybody or anything. So sometimes let's say I'm, uh, somebody is reacting to me in a really uh, random way and I'm like, what the hell is this person talking? If I'm lamenting loudly, he'll be like, why don't you think of it the other way? And in the next moment, I think thankfully, uh, thankfully, most times I'm a sane individual, so <laughs> I look at I'm immediately looking at the other point of view. I'm like, yeah, right. Why didn't I think of this? So he always dissipates, um, and he lives by this benefit of doubt. Give benefit of doubt. I think all the time he gives benefit of doubt. And I don't think he really takes anything at face value, or rather, he takes things at uh, and even if, especially if it is negative or if, if you perceive some negativity, he will be like, no, 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 it's absolutely fine, don't think about it. So the more positive you are to things, the more positivity will come to you. I'm like, some days I can, most days I'm like, fine, some days I'm like, I can't take this. <laughs> I'm going to rant and let me rant. <laughs> Thankfully, my uh, his mom, uh, my mom-in-law and I, uh, you know, gang up on that against him. So <laughs> those days are his bad days. But he, he is somebody who in this two plus years of knowing him, one and a half of being married, I have never once uh, heard him gossip about somebody. I'm married to him, but he doesn't gossip about anybody to me. And uh, and I'm not saying this for the sake of cameras, just, right. the way, just the way he is. And he also doesn't listen to gossip about anybody from anybody else. So that I think is some, is uh, is a mark of somebody who as a human being and I'm not saying because I'm married to him I'm, I'm glad that I am able to share this life with somebody as uh, who has such lofty ideals but I think all of us at some level decide to speak about somebody sometimes it's parliamentary sometimes it's not so he reminds me to be a to always be the better person right so it, it's good to have a a walking living <laughs> example boy right in front of you sometimes it's irritating I can tell you that <laughs> I'm like, oh, okay, all right, <laughs> I want to be right now, I want to be, you know, gorging on chocolate and everything else, can you like not be Buddha Bhagavan, <laughs> I'm not interested, <laughs> for example, like that. So, mm -hmm. but yeah, I think I have, not once has he uh, complained, not, uh, even when he was at the receiving end of a lot of nonsense, and I will be, <laughs> I will be like, on, on uh, you know, burning coals of sorts, because I, I get angry when, Things right. are not right. He doesn't. <laughs> like, how I've never seen him angry, you know, no. for pa past three years, right? No, never. And I, uh, I, I don't get it. I think once, if, if he loses it, he apparently goes silent or something like that. But I think it was probably once, but I can't even remember for how long he was angry. I don't think he was angry really. But yeah, he's, uh, he's a very interesting individual, always, and also very, very worldly wise, in the sense of he. He knows the world around, he's also curious about the world. He, he, I learned a lot about, um, he loves reading and okay. geopolitics or anything else. He has, he has a very interesting perspective on things. The other day I remember going and repeating one of his perspectives on uh, this uh, black mirror. Mm -hmm. And uh, Rahman sir said, no, I'm not thinking. I'm not thinking. I'm not thinking. That would be my husband. He told me this and hence. <laughs> So yeah, I mean, he is a very interesting uh, mind. I I really love listening, uh, reading his uh, reviews and his point of uh, view on the films that he watches. And I think one of one such conversation is what eventually ended up uh, in us getting to know each other better and dating, and then eventually getting married. A conversation about the Ramayana. Mm. You don't know, hey, I love you. You don't have to say that. You say, just say I love you. I mean, you. Sitting that close to someone, why would you scream out Ki, I love you or right. unless they are at the other end of the road or something, right? So, <laughs> he'll say, brother, brother. she's right <laughs> next to you or he's right and she don't shout, don't down, don't down, don't no. down. 